Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Pokewon. I'm Dre Gottams and I think is this the guy before with the Latios and now he's on a Moltres or is this someone new? I was there, this is just like the stunting rock, stunting corner where people come and show off all their great Pokemon. But well, welcome back to a, another episode, our second episode of this wonderful Pokemon MMO, Pokemon. We just started uh, last time, we got our Pokemon, we got a lovely Bulbasaur, and we gathered a few other Pokemon, walked around here in the forest, and now we're starting to fight. And uh, we're just kind of starting our, our, our way in the Kanto region. I wonder if we're fast enough to run away from this Rattata. And we got away safely, okay, good to see. Um, and just like the old school Pokemon games, there are a lot of battles, a lot of encounters. Oh, we failed to run away. Uh, can we try again? I wonder if fail to run away once means you're always going to fail. Like, they're just too fast for you. Uh, 12. Ooh, almost one shot it though. But that's good that there's a lot of battles. I want it to feel old school. I want to be back in the good old days of red and blue. So here we are. We're going to make our way up here. We have to continue on through uh, this, I guess, Route 1 here. I guess this. I guess I was looking for uh, last episode uh, about like where our quests are. Like I think these are, like these are kind of, oh no, hold on. There you go. Those are achievements and where you can kind of get achievement points per day. But there's also quests, and then if you click on here, this is where the quest is. So yeah, we have to challenge Nancy on Route 1. Where's Nancy? Where are you, Nancy? Uh, maybe Nancy's up here. Where are you there, Nancy? I don't see him. We'll keep going here through the grass there. I wonder what that is. Is that like a like a slack off? There's Larry. Oh yeah. Okay, we saw Larry from before. Nancy must be up this way. Oh, last Nancy. Okay, there we go. Cool. I've got a few Pokemon. You want to see them? Not really. But all right. I guess it'll be nice. Ooh, has a Meowth. Let's go ahead and take down this Meowth. And I think when she switches Pokemon, we'll switch. Whoa, he actually hit pretty hard. Yo, take it easy, meow. What's your deal? Yeah, we're gonna wanna keep him alive some, so... There's a Pidgey. Oh yeah, Pidgey was actually causing us a lot of damage last time. So let's go ahead and switch on over. Let's go ahead over to our... Let's go to Rattata. He's strong, level 6. Got a really good quick attack. So we'll go ahead and make sure... Take that down there. And hit him with another quick attack. Break him off a piece of that quick attack. Alright, alright, that wasn't so bad. My Pokemon are hurt. Are yours? Pokemon can be healed in every Poke Center. Talk to Nurse Joy, she will help you out. Whoa, okay. And quest complete. Did we get anything for that? Oh yeah, so there was it. XP and stuff, so okay, when there's a quest, I gotta look up here to see what happens. Oh, nice, now we're in a new city. Now we're in Viridian City. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's a shiny Embryon. Awesome. Ooh, Officer Jenny. Let's see what Officer Jenny has to say. Hi, my name is Officer Jenny. What's your name? Drake Adams. Okay. It's my job to handle all kinds of problems. And that's a lot to do, not only here, but everywhere around the region. Maybe you want to help me and earn some bounties? Today, you can choose five more bounties. Okay. Yeah, choose a bounty. What are bounties? Please select a, a bounty of your choice. Defeat Rattata on Route 1, defeat Weedle on Route 2, and Mankey on Route 22. Oh, wow. Well, I know that we can do this one really easily. Actually, let's do the Weedle on Route 2. Let's keep on moving forward. Let's not move backwards. We need more information about Weedle. To do this, you'll have to defeat or catch one of them. Can you help me out? Accept bounty. Download battle data. data. I accept. Okay. Cool. So, 
We have that. Uh, we can also heal up. Let's go ahead and heal up. Bulbasaur takes damage. He's not very strong. And here is the uh, Poke Center. We got a, a bro chilling up here, Carlo. I wonder if I can look at this map. That'd be cool if it zoomed in. Nah, it doesn't. Carlo, what's going on? Nurse Joy told me about uh, that PC downstairs. You can use it. So kind of her. Okay, cool. So that's where we can store some extra Pokemon. And if things run into the spill off. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and heal up. Talk to Nurse Joy. Hello! Welcome to Poke Center. My name is Joy. Feel free to come around anytime you need to heal your Pokemon. When your Pokemon have all fainted, you will return to the last visited Poke Center. So it's a good idea to visit every Poke Center. We also heal any status conditions your Pokemon may have. We are always open. There's not always a Poke Center around, so you should carry some potions with you. The Poke Mart where you can buy items is not far away. Go take a look. Oh yeah, we will do that. Good point. Um, well, can I heal up? Yes. Thank you, thank you. And actually... Yep, we'll take care, we'll take care. Let's see, player information. That should have our money, right? Okay. I guess I'm not seeing it. Let's go to the uh, Pokemart. And the Pokemart, we'll see if we can buy some potions. Okay, yeah, potions would definitely be an important thing to have. This is really nice. The graphics do look pretty cool for, for like a free game like this. It's kind of fun. Oh, look at that. Uh, for it. Hey, Carl. What's going on? Welcome to Pokemon. You can buy any item you want. We are not a very big mart, so our selection is, isn't very large, but all of our items are very useful. Did you know that there is a trainer school in town? We build it for new trainers. You should visit Dizzy there. She can teach you something about Pokemon. Oh, nice. Just leveled up. Got loot box, leveled up, get experience. Okay. You can help me buy potion. Okay, we have so 870. Yeah, we're going to need potion... Oh, wow. That... Oh, and actually we need a Pokeball, too. Okay, let's do one of each. Let's buy a Pokeball. And let's buy a Potion. Okay. Alright, that worked out. That's better. Hey, let's check with Timmy, see if he has anything good. Nope. Sell some antidotes around here. We don't want no antidotes. Where we're going, we don't need antidotes. Which is actually not true. We probably do. Uh, that looks like a house. Is this a school? Let's read the sign here. Maybe this will tell us. Yep, trainer school. Alright, let's see if Dizzy has something helpful for us. Hey, it's a little Squirtle rocking around. Yeah, wow, look at all these other people playing the game. They're all over here. All over here talking to Dizzy. Hello! Were you sent by Carl from the Mart? Okay, I want you to participate in a little quiz about status conditions. And this is all about non-volatile status conditions. Do you want to start right away or do you need some time to study? Let's start. Here we go. This question, which status condition can be healed with an awakening? That'll be the SLP for sleep. That's right. Sleeping Pokemon needs awakening. Let's see, how many non-volatile status conditions are there? Oh, wow. So, sleep, volatile. I mean, poison seems to be, that does damage. So, sleep, paralysis, confusion. I think it would just be three. We'll go with two. Oh, no, not the right answer. There are five. What else is there? Oh, frozen? Yeah, stuff like that. Which status condition totally immobilizes Pokemon? That would be two, Frozen. I guess that's true. Frozen is another one. Which status condition does not inflict ongoing damage? Uh, number three, Paralysis. Last question. Which status conditions remain after battle? Poison, Burn. I think all of these 
will remain. Does the sleep remain? Yeah, the sleep does. All. That's right. All non-volatile status conditions remain after battle. Burn is a volatile one. It does damage to you. Interesting to know. Poison and burn don't deal damage outside battle. Okay, something they, they must have updated that at some point. Okay, let's see. Not bad, not bad. There's still something to learn, but there's always. Take some money and keep learning. When you want to go to Viridian Forest, start with the Northern Road. An old man has been sitting there for the whole day. You can't miss him. And don't forget to prepare for longer journeys. Always take some items with you. Okay. Received Poke Dollars, Loot Box. Nice. Alright. Let's open these up. I think it's always good for us to open them up right away because we need items like, yeah, Hyper Potion. We need pokeballs all that all that good stuff max elixir more pokey dollars okay good let's go on downstairs see what's going on here this is kind of cool I wouldn't be surprised if there's a hidden item here darn it oh and there's some training they're doing here I don't know if we want to s oh no okay yeah, let's get out of here. Let's not get wrapped up in all this. Okay. I see that they do reward you for doing side quests and things, which is good. So, let's go ahead and get out of here. I think our next uh, quest, yeah, is to visit the old man in Viridian City. So we can keep it moving. Yo, Cole. Watch out for you. Ah, nice. Had a feeling whenever there's like something off to a different direction, it's always good to go that way. See what's over there. Anything else even further down? Oh no. And it exit outs. So we, yeah, we gotta get a, um, like a mount. A bike or something. Let's see. Mounts. 2,000, so yeah, it's going to be 2,000 minimum. Oh, man. We're only at 140. Surf mounts. Fly mounts. Oh, okay, so we could already fly with the Pidgey. Nice. Okay. Old Man Sansu. Well, my eyes may be weak, but isn't this a young trainer crossing my path? What do you seek, young trainer? You want to move on? Do you feel strong enough to face my Pokemon? You didn't expect me to be a trainer, did you? Eh, eh, eh. What you got, old man? You got a Weedle? He's got a Weedle. Let's go ahead and switch. Let's go straight off the top to Pidgey. Does Poison Sting. Oof. Oh, no, Amber Poison? Okay, this Pidgey's gonna go down quick, I can tell. Hopefully we can kill... Oh, man, I don't know if he's gonna last. We might have to sub him out. Just to make sure he gets credit for the, uh, the fight. Another hard attack for six, though, so that's good. And... No, actually, we could uh, kill him. It's just the just the poison like effect afterwards which is hurting us, but that's good. So as Weedle goes down, I don't know if that's gonna count for our quest there. But yeah, we're gonna actually swap him out because we don't want to die from that poison. I don't think we're gonna do anything with this hoot hoot ever. So let's go ahead and I think we can go with the Ratata. I wanna have a nice balance of, of, of Pokemon and strengths and stuff. Once we get to uh, the first gym, like the, the rock gym with Brock, our Bulbasaur is going to be doing all of the work there, so we can let these guys have some fun right now. we we'll go with another quick attack, the battle of the quick attack, Raditus. Our quick attack was more quick. Oh, and there's another Weedle. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and I guess we'll, we'll go ahead and switch over to Bulbasaur then. Everyone got in like a fight. As long as everyone got to join in on the fun, that's all good. Yeah, we're not worried about poison, are we, Bulbasaur? 
we are a poison type. So yeah, we're gonna have to just use tackle for now. The like the grass moves are not very effective against uh, the bug or the flying. Oh no, I did it out of habit. I see like the stronger move, like the technically stronger move, and I just want want to attack it. But right now, tackles are a better bet. And we took him down. Well, Viridian Forest is waiting for you. Just leveled up. We completed a quest. We got some Poke Dollars, loot box. Oh, and Armand's Bulbasaur leveled up. Oh, Pidgey leveled up as well. Okay. All right, all right. Discovered a new area. We still have that Weedle bounty. Whoa, check that guy. It's got a skull mask on. There's a bug catcher yellow. <laughs> this guy is screaming yellow. You have to roam far to get new kinds of Pokemon. Do you want to see my Pokemon? You show me yours, I'll show you mine. So a lot more of these bug types. And now we're at level 9? I thought we were just at level 8. I guess we did level up. I, th I wasn't 100% sure, but that confirms it. That's that confirmation right there. Okay, so Weedle goes down with the tackle, so that's easy enough. Got the rat tag again. Um, darn. I would put in Pidgey. I do like want to see Pidgey get up there. I think a Pidgeot would, would be a good strong Pokemon to have. But the poison has me kind of afraid. So I don't think he would survive a, a quick attack from the Rattata. Just being 100% honest. Uh, I have to look for a new Pokemon. Yeah. Go. Go look for a new Pokemon. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and get this item. And, oh, uh, Paralyze Heal. Go okay, we can take that. Let's see. Okay, let's fight a Weedle in here, though. That's not Weedle. Can we run? Oh gosh. These Rattatas are going to be the death of us. Can we run? I do want to... I'm tempted to see if... Yeah, okay, so far, with what we can tell... Oh my gosh. So far, if, if you fail to run, I haven't seen us like... Like I guess able to run after failing a run, so I don't know if that just like means okay they're th they're just too fast and it's never gonna work, or if it's some sort of like RNG or dice roll. Um, I guess it wouldn't be RNG, but if it's a dice roll, uh, it doesn't appear to be that yet because we're failing every time. Uh, damn! Look at all these Squirtles. The Squirtle Squad around us. Whoa, Ledian, level nine. Holy smokes! Oh wait, no. Let's use. Quick ball, or I mean timer ball. Is that how that works? Hey, hey, got the Letty in. Nice, raise a Pokemon to level ten. Bubble Sword is up to level eleven, and we got the Letty in. One, two, three. All right, nice. It's huge. That guy's massive. That guy's absolutely massive. And then there's a Letty Buh. Get out of here. Oh, actually, we should. I'm not really at the stage of like, come on, I can't run away from a level three. Oh, okay, so. Uh, Bulbasaur is at level 11, but since we're at level 9, it's dropping him down to level 11, to, to level 9. That is good to know. Okay. So we do want to get our level up whenever possible. Uh, let's go ahead and start with the Pidgey, and then we'll swap into something else. We, we want to find a, a Weedle right now. We have a bounty out for it. No! No, damn ya! Uh, let's see if you can survive a hit. Might be pretty risky. And it was, because he's going to faint because of the poison. Unfortunate for us, 
we can go with I guess a Ledian. Ledian's kind of cool. What kind of moves you got? Oh, you got Swift tackle. Let's try Swift. Guaranteed to land. Hey, this Ledian's great. Challenger. Okay, nice. We got that. Again, 70 experience. We're getting close to level 10. We do want to get to level 10. Stupid Pidgey. You really let, let me down, Pidgey. I hope you know that. I hope you know that you let me down. Without poison. Come on, Weedle. Weedle, where are you? Ugh. Another Pidgey. Assuming too fast. Yeah, running is tough indeed. And we'll use Vine Whip. Not effective, of course. Drake Adams, you're, you are better than that. Sorry about that, guys. Let's go ahead and use Tackle. And that'll get us out of it. Cool, 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 cool. Very good. Very good, my friend. Our Bulbasaur is getting beat up, too, now. Well, since we can't... Okay, so... Alright, strategy time. There's no point kind of power leveling a Pokemon once it's beyond your level, because they just won't really see that effect until you level up more. So we can slow him down. Ooh, the spin rack. That's new. We might actually catch the spin rack. I like Aridos. Oh gosh. This might be tough. Let's see if Swift does more damage. That tackle did nothing. Okay, there we go. That's better. Spin rack use infestation. Oh, I lost what? Lost my health. Okay, let's do this attack here. And we'll do one more. Let's do one more swift attack, and then we're gonna throw a Pokeball if he survives. Nice. And items. Let's go with a Pokeball. Let's get that Spinarak. Perfect. There we are. Counter 10 different Pokemon. Okay, got cool. Got these points here. Let's go ahead and heal up. Oh, let's look. Hey, look at the Ledian. This is cool. So I guess whoever's in your active spot, they're going to be walking behind you. Watch out, watch out. Yo, back up, back up, back up, back up. Okay. Oh, Ludicolo? What? Where'd you get that Ludicolo? Can I has it? K Pop Tarts. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, yes, please. Heal us all on up. Thank you kindly, Nurse Joy. So we're getting. I mean, obviously, you want to catch the stuff that's around. But we have a lot of bugs and stuff. Let someone heal your Pokemon five times. Good indeed. We need to get, like, this stuff leveled up, though. So, we need daily quests. I don't think there is PvP in the game yet. So, we're not going to worry about that. But we, d we can do, oh, two bounties. That can get, a get us some more level. Right now, we're on one bounty. Uh, let's go ahead and put Pidgey up there. Gosh, out of the way, people. It's hard to tell. I guess the white lettering is uh, NPC. And those people we can't run through, people with blue are actual people playing the game. There's a lot of people playing, too. Okay. <laughs> There's Bug Catcher YOLO. Living life a quarter mile at a time. I think we need Cut to get through this, yeah? Alright. <laughs> and there's Viagra. Chilling at level 14. What's this? Ooh, ooh. Hey, Holly. A any news for us? Do you love Pokemon like I do? I bet you use them for battle. Here, you probably need this more than I do. I'm glad we talked to her. Oh, Antidote. Darn, I thought she was going to give us like, a Pokeball or something. No, wait, no, wait. Uh, let me get out of here. Hey, Officer Steward. Hello, Trainer. The way to the north leads to Viridian Forest. The way to the south leads to Viridian City. Thank you. 
cool dude chilling on a glacier on there. Okay. Whoa, discover. Okay, cool. I'm not sure what these things do for us, though. If it's just, like, for your own kind of, like, s bragging rights, I guess? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, I don't think we can use these to, like, trade in anything. But that's cool, I guess. And here's a whole list of all of the, uh, the achievements. Yeah. Good old achievement points. Oh, we have a loot box. Oh, okay. Uncle Doug. <laughs> Hey, you, just a moment, please. What is your name? Drake Adams. Okay, would you mind helping me, Drake Adams? It won't take long. My niece, Lara, went to the western part of the forest. I haven't seen her for a while. I just want you to find out if, if everything is all right. Nice. There we go. We got level 10, so that'll be good for our Bulbasaur. There's Bug Catcher Ricky. Always up to no good. Lara, somewhere to the west, could you please take a look? Yo, dude. Oh, okay. So it won't let me hang out over there yet. What's going on up here? Deep and sprawling. That? Yes, indeed. Serena, have you seen Lara? Maybe you can help me out. Sometimes people get lost in the old forest. I want to draw a map. I need you to explore all regions of the forest. We'll link our Pokedex and you'll send me your position when you enter a new region. What do you say? What did it be? Thank you. Take your time and explore the forest. Knowing the ways and the corners of the region is always useful. Okay. Got that test. Oh, wow. There's a guy chilling with the Spinarak. Or, uh, Ariados, actually. The evolved Spinarak. I wonder what these people are doing over here. They're just hanging out? Ooh, Metapod. Actually, ah, there's so many Pokemon and I don't have enough balls. Okay, I gotta get a Butterfree. Alright, that's a must. Okay... He's just... <laughs> Good thing about him, he's, he's never gonna attack us, is he? He's, he's gonna do a step back. Oh, there he is, he's doing that step back. Harden. Uh, okay. I think he's low enough for us to catch him. Got two Pokeballs. Here we go. Mmm. Oh, man. That's expensive. Metapod. I have one Pokeball left. I know. When I don't, when I don't have any Pokeballs left, that's when something great's going to pop out. Okay, we're uh, okay. We're gonna catch them here. Here we go. Actually, we can probably do one more hit. Unless it's a crit. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, it won't go up any like any higher, bro. So chill out. Okay, come on. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Give it to us. Come on. There's two. There we go. There we go. Hey, hey, hey. All right. We are out of Pokeballs, but we got Metapod, so we're gonna we're gonna take out a Hoot Hoot. Probably the Hoot Hoot's not doing anything. He can go. Bye. Um, so I think what we're we're gonna end the episode there. Uh, we're gonna come back um, next time and continue our adventures in Viridian Forest. I guess we gotta try to find Lara, make sure she's okay. We also gotta do these bounties, like yeah either capture or defeat a Weedle, and then I want to do another bounty so then we can uh, get these quests done and get some extra XP so we can gain levels. Uh, but yeah, having a lot of fun. I hope you guys are enjoying this. This is just, I don't know, it's just too much fun playing Pokemon, especially in the MMO space. So we're going to come back again with more action. As of always, I've been Drake Adams. You guys have just been great, and I'll see you next time. Take care.